Hello friends welcome to Loxio Tech YouTube channel. This video shows you how to install Linux or Ubuntu LTS server version 22.04. LTS version means long-term support. That means this version gets latest update up to 5 years compared to normal versions of Ubuntu that gives update up to only 2 or 3 years. For downloading Ubuntu server, go to Google and search Ubuntu 20.04 LTS. and open the link from official Ubuntu website. Then click server option from the top menu and select the option manual server installation and click download Ubuntu server 22.04.1 LTS link. It will start the downloading process automatically. Wait to finish the download. Now you got Ubuntu Server LTS ISO image file. You need Power ISO to create bootable disk. Download Power ISO from Google or you can directly download the link given in the description. Download and install Power ISO. Click close, then open Power ISO. Click open from the top menu option and select Ubuntu ISO file from the browser. Then click tools from the top menu and select the option, create bootable USB drive in Power ISO. Click OK to reopen with administrator privileges. Select designation as your USB drive and put the other settings as default. Please note you need a USB or DVD of at least 4GB space to create bootable Ubuntu drive. Click start to create bootable USB. Wait to finish the process it will take time to complete depending on the speed of your USB disk. After completing the process, restart the system. Go to BIOS settings and set the first booting device as USB in UEFI mode. Check your motherboard manual for finding the BIOS key. Then again restart and boot from pen drive. Select the option, try or install Ubuntu server. Select your the language and hit enter. There is no mouse cursor while installing Ubuntu server. Use keyboard directional arrow keys and enter button to select the options in menu. Select the keyboard layout. Set as default layout and select done and hit enter. Then choose type of install. Here two options are available, Ubuntu server and minimized versions. Leave the other options as default and then select done and hit enter. Also leave the network connection settings as default. Use keyboard directional key to select the options you want and hit enter to select any particular options from the list. Skip the proxy address and Ubuntu archive sections. Here in storage configuration, please check the hard disk drive. Here I use VBOX 160 GB hard disk. Check the name and ensure that the correct hard disk is selected as target drive or installation media. Select done and hit enter. If you want to format or create a partition, select the second option under Use Devices and hit Enter and again select Edit option. And set the file size and format mode. And save the settings to create a new partition. Or leave the file system summary as default, select Done and hit Enter. Then type name, user ID and password. Again select done and hit enter. These are the list of default server softwares available in this LTS server package.
select done and hit enter to start the installation process. Please wait a couple of minutes to complete the installation process. After completing the installation, remove the USB drive or DVD from the drive and restart system. Type login username and password. It's done. Ubuntu LTS version successfully installed. If you want to install Apache web server, then type the command sudo space apt space install space apache2. Commands are given in the description box. Apache web server successfully installed in your Ubuntu server system. Hope you like this video. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe, and also post your valuable comments. Thanks for watching, see you in the next video.